felt like it was forever since I filmed and it probably is <laughs> and I've spent all day fixing the apartment because I will get a visitor tomorrow and we will record videos and I have a very annoyed Goomba let's see if I can show him he's annoyed <laughs> I don't know why but he's did you miss Nerd? Today it's the second to last, is that how you say it? In Swedish we would say the uh, the nest sista. It's the nest sista <laughs> uh, in the UVS Play series. Like I said before, I have more because I have more palettes, but those will not come up on Sundays. But you already know that, probably. And today it's time for the warrior and we are going to do the same thing that I did with the Nubian one I think it was and it's fun with neutrals it looks like this and fun with neutrals is that you can't use the lightest shade but you have to use the darkest so I'm not allowed to use that shade which is kind of sad because there are only three mattes in this palette and that is one of them. <laughs> and then I have to use that shade and that is a dark matte. So yeah, I don't know if I have used this palette. I have swatched it, but I don't think I have used it. So I guess it's just, I don't have my mirror. <laughs> I just have my other mirror. Ugh, I look like crap. Never mind. I'm so annoyed because I got palettes yesterday from Peachy Queen and it took its time but not an a normal long a normal that's not what you say. It's it took time but it's not unusual that it takes that time from uh, uh, when when I order from I guess it were from the States because I paid customs, but yeah. Uh, but the annoying thing was that I ordered four palettes and one of them was um, Never Trust the Living, which was the whole reason I ordered it uh, or ordered. And when I opened the package, that palette was not there. And that is so annoying because that's exactly what happened with the ABH palette. And like I said before, it's one thing if a palette is broken, because then you can send a picture of it being broken, but it's really hard to show that you don't get a palette because you know, you can just not show it in pictures. And so I don't see why you would do that because if I would do that with no reason than to fool the company, I still have to pay, you know, customs for it. So there is no win for me to lie. <laughs> But it's so hard for me to prove it because the only way is to take a photo of the box and how much it weighed. But I have already thrown away the box and I don't know. And I still have not received any reply and I wrote to the company yesterday. It's been more than 24 hours. It's annoying. I hope she will reply, but she hasn't replied to my other emails I have sent her. So I don't have that much hope, but we'll have to see. It's a weekend, so maybe she's not working weekends. So I will see next, you know, on Monday and so on. But I really hope she replies. Okay, let's see. Then I guess we are going to take, that's the only rules, you know, you don't have to use all the shades or anything, but I guess I'm going to take the other mat <laughs> and use that in the crease. And you are also kind, you know, to, you know, I didn't feel that good. I'm finally feeling better. But it has taken a week. It's so annoying. Um, I've not been feeling well at all. And um, 
thank you for caring <laughs> because uh, like probably most of you know is the reason I'm telling you is not that you uh, I want you to feel sorry for me but you know I think it feels better to share and I also feel better when other people share so that's why and also I'm usually talking about what's on my mind and that has been on my mind and I'm also very nervous because Monday and Tuesday is it called Tuesday I hope so uh, I'm going to do something at work that I'm very nervous about it's a good and interesting thing but I'm nervous so I can't really relax this weekend either yeah. I'm a bit conflicted about some stuff but fun thing is uh, the Novena volume 2 was released in Sweden yesterday so I ordered it and collected it today so now I have it over there and it's so much prettier in real life that it looks on pictures and they really complement each other they are all very beautiful in their own way but if I were to rate them just I've only used the volume 3 but if I were to rate them uh, color wise right now I would say that the volume 3 is the prettiest then volume 2 and then volume 1 but it all depends on what shades you like and I really like this shade. It's more reddish warm than it looks in the pan. And I really like it. I really like it. Now I'm going to take the dark. It's a very dark brown, almost black. And it looks really cool tone. Yep. So I'm having a warm and a cool <laughs> brown. But that's can work and I was like what is that sound but I'm uh, having laundry so yeah yay I don't even know what time it is like that. now the question is what shade we're going to have on the lid I think we're going to have to swatch all the shimmers so I can see what they look like no, now I took the wrong shade. Like that. This shade was not that easy to blend out like the other one. But it's still a good matte. I'm not worried when it's UVS place, you know. that I'm just going to take a fluffy brush don't have anything on it but I just want to blend out the edges even more I wish I had more lid space and more space before my brow comes along but yeah can't do nothing about it I always envy those you know that do looks with a lot of colors on the lid I can't do that because there is no room and they won't show up now I'm just blending 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 and like I said I don't have anything on my brush Okay, let's swatch the shimmers. Ooh. They are pretty. There are six shimmers. I th I think I already know which I want, but I want to see them swatched. So 
that's how they look. Mm -hmm. So pretty. Let's see. That I will have in the inner corner. I'm going to go with my gut feeling. And now I will be brown. Let's see. I'm going to spray it. I'm taking Bakwa, the second to last shade I swatched. I think it looks cool and it is cool tone but warm tone at the same time so I think it has a very weird shift so I think that will be good it's good that it's only golds kind of or golds and browns because I think golds are pretty, but I rarely use them because I usually use other colors first. Like that. It's so foil. We will have a neutral, obviously. It's almost like a cut crease. <laughs> Yay! And this is almost yellow. I like that. Do, 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 do. Let's take. That should not be there. We're going to take a bit of that dark shade, matte, and put it here. That. And then I'm taking the other matte shade. to take no, I'm, going to, I'm going to take the lightest shimmer uh, Moremi Moremi, I don't know and put it in the inner corner and I will also take it under the eye Did I say that this was the collab between me, Linda and Malin? I don't know, I just assume that you all know that by now. Because I think this is, for me, I think it's part 11. Like that. Yeah. God, that turned wet. <laughs> Ooh, wet. Ooh. Too much. Too much. I'm taking a bit of that shimmer that I have on the lid. I don't think I have fallout. Maybe just a little. Yeah, there I can see I have four. <laughs> God, I took 
too much like that I think so I'm going to go and do my base and then I will be back and we'll see how it looks so wait now I'm back <laughs> and I have a combination of uh, Linda Halvai Levy Flash in the waterline and uh, the crayon from Crayola or whatever that was sold at Sephora <laughs> and I have Christmas cookie on the lips because everyone loves Christmas cookies so I was like well I have to try it and I like it and I'm extremely shiny because I use this powder a little too much uh, the one I talked about in some other video <laughs> uh, as a setting powder it's so shiny uh, it's the ow opalescent one and I was kind of heavy handed with it <laughs> so I'm very shiny and I used a shiny blush and a shiny highlighter which highlighter? Yeah, it was too faced. But yeah, I kind of like it. And I really like the look I did with uh, the Warrior palette. Um, like, I used one, two, three, four shades. Okay. Only four shades. I used that one, that one, that one, oops, and that one. Yeah, sometimes you don't need more. And fun with neutrals, like if you have seen this video from the beginning, which you probably have, <laughs> is where you can't use the lightest shade, which is this matte, but you have to use the darkest shade, which I did. And uh, it has disappeared a bit, but yeah. So this is a classic neutral. That's the thing with neutrals, because the looks always looks good. Uh, it's never crazy. You can always go out, you can always do whatever. Um, maybe this is a bit shinier, because I think a lot of people who do neutral neutral has like all mattes and maybe a satin on the lid. That's my, what's that called? What's that called? What is that? Look. Prejudice? Oh, fun, it's a fodum. It's a fodum going. I can't remember. If I remember, I put it here. But you know. That, at least. And I... Looks like I have a spot here with bronzer, which I don't have. And now it's getting late, so I will have to go and wash this off again, which is very sad. I really like this lip. I like this color. I know why everyone is so crazy about it. Yeah. And that was all, and now we only have one palette left in this series where we all are together. And that will come up next Sunday, and after that... Oh, my brows are not even... Yeah. Uh, we will start our new series, and that will be so much fun. Uh, but we... we I will talk more about that when that is coming up, which is in two weeks, I guess. So I have to hurry up because I have a lot of other palettes that uh, from the UVS that I want to use before, so yeah. Uh, but go check out Marlin and Linda, they are always linked down below, but their videos, uh, you know, the corresponding videos are linked just down below if you just open the box. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I think that was all. And I have been a bit off. I was, my plan was to film, so I would have one Zodiac video a week and one Huda Beauty video a week. But that has not worked out because life. So yeah, we'll see when that gets back on track. Ooh, that rhyme. 
really like this look, even though it's neutral. Ah. Even though I like neutrals, neutral looks, it's just that I don't think they are that exciting. Um, and they are not very hard to do. Um, but yeah, stop talking. Uh, so that was all for this video. And tomorrow I will have a guest here. Let's see when that video comes up. Probably next week, I hope. So, 